Sibel Hepsayar was born in Turkey. She graduated from Dukuz Eylül University. She worked as a regional manager in Turkey important company for many years. She started her first ceramic education in 2006. She established her own ceramic studio in Esmir in 2016. She participated in many international group exhibitions, ceramic workshops, ceramic symposium, and congress at home and abroad. She is a member of Chamber of Mechanical Engineer and Turkish Ceramic Association. Uh, hello everyone, I'm Arzu Zerga and this is the interview of the Bon Art Project. In this program, uh, Sibel Hepsayar from uh, Turkey is our guest. Welcome Sibel, how are you? Fine, thanks. Uh, and you? I'm so excited uh, you are here and we can talk about about the concept of exhibition and about your work. Um, uh, I, uh, my question is about how you connect with your work and the concept of the, this exhibition, I mean the transformation. I am questioning what living a beautiful life in my work. Uh, is it really living that life flows in a straight line? Life is in constant transformation. Good and bad things happen in life. There is also happiness and unhappiness. Please look around. Everything turns into something. We are transformed from moment to moment by the influence of what we read, watch, and our environment. Our ideas are transforming our appearance is transforming, the world is transforming. This transformation does not scare me. This is normal, not always bad. I make the double wall bold to express these ideas. Mm -hmm. These not normally have a flat uh, top surface. It is similar to sphere in half. I am actually spoiling these double wall balls. However, I have noticed that the balls look better for me. At this point, I saw the relationship between transformation. I think the important thing is to accept this transformation and make an effort to make this transformation positive. The flatness, recesses, waves, and ramps in my words represent the transformation of life and the flow of life. Finally, I want to say, while accepting life with its wrong and right, I hope to present a holistic and positive perspective instead of instant assessment. Oh, it's great. Thank you. And uh, my second question is about the virtual exhibition. Uh, maybe, I don't know, um, have you ever been uh, or have you ever participated uh, in virtual exhibition? Uh, what was your experiences? And my question is about how think about the future of this sort of exhibition, this kind of exhibition, I mean. Okay. Uh, with the pandemic, uh, most of the events in the exhibition halls have been postponed or cancelled. For this reason, the importance of social media and online exhibitions has increased. In the past, people were going to the exhibitions. Now, online exhibitions are starting to go to the people. With online exhibitions, we can show our works to more people with the features we want. We are now away from art collectors, galleries, and curators around the world. I believe that quality online exhibitions will make serious contributions to artists. In addition, collectors will be able to discover new artists at these exhibitions. 
Thank you so much for giving me the opportunity to express my thoughts. Oh, actually, thank you for chance to speaking with you. Thank you.